hello guys this is open gyan house and this is our very first video on youtube the main objective of this video will be to demonstrate how the host communicate with vm and this is the network configuration part when we are trying it for very first time so due to an availability of related content it took around 5 and 6 hours of troubleshooting and believe me 5 and 6 hours is too much for it as you can even travel to dubai in the same time so just understand our setup first we have one server which is base and in base server we have installed virtual box and whenever you install the virtual box in your setup you get one interface it is called vboxnet so you can see in vboxnet there is one ip which is already configured is 192.168.56.1 so what we did we use this interface in our network setting of virtual box you can see in network part there is we are using adapter 1 in adapter 1 we have configured host only adapter and host only adapter we are using the same interface which is on base and just click on okay and after that you need to configure same ip in your compute node which is your vm and when you configure the same subnet ip over here so at that time you are able to ping your base so i have configured uh, the same subnet ip which is 192.168.56.103 and my base ip is 1 so from base i will show you the ping with my vm so you can see like my vm is pingable from the base machine and it's vice versa like if you if you want to see the ping from here so you can see like my base is also ping your from here so from this you can achieve your base and host communication and the other part if you need to communicate your vm internally so at that point you need one more adapter and which i enabled already and you can see here i am using the internal network which is running on intel so the same network configuration you need to configure in your vm and if i will show you here like you can see i have used eth2 and eth2 i am using the 10.0.0.31 ip uh, the same subnet ip which you need to configure in the another vm as well so if you see like uh, the same interface eth2 here so i am using the same subnet ip which is 10.0.0.31 and our control node is 10.0.0.11 so here i will show you the ping between the vm Yes, you can see the internal communication is also working here. Yeah. So this is the main concept of this video, and hope this is helpful to you. Thanks for watching. Thanks. Bye bye. Sayonara. Welcome back soon.